Robert Griffith was part of the double zone coverage on that last one. He read the play, got in there, and got the interception. Peter, you couldn't ask for more from him today. He has done his part. And then some. So far, he's got two interceptions. The Vikings come out on offense and are well ahead. They have yet another shot to score and start this drive at their 42-yard line. Number 26 gets the call on first down and rambles for about five. Teddy Bruski with the tackle. Second down with two tight ends to the right. Number 26 gets the call again and maybe picks up one on the play. Number 26 stuck close to his blockers, but the play folded quicker than an over-caffeinated origami artist. He's not made much headway up the middle, although it's not for lack of trying, and that's for sure. They can't get effective blocking there. You gotta go elsewhere. Moss catches it in the flat, and he's just short of the first down. Fourth down coming up. Randy Moss got out of bounds after getting some yardage, but you can tell that it wasn't as much as he wanted. Peter, they couldn't get the last few yards they wanted, and now it is fourth down. Boy, a good call, but as you said, they just couldn't get the last few yards they needed. Number 26 bulldozes right of center and converts the fourth down. First what down a Michael. fantastic play. Number 26 played smart and used his blockers to perfection on that last play. They convert the fourth and there's some excited faces down there on the field. Oh boy, nothing can amp up an offense like a big play. That's how you get the first. And that's what they've got, first down. First down, 10 yards to go. Number 21 makes a play on this and forces the incompletion. Number seven is showing off some precision passing out there, Dan. Clearly, he's exploiting the short game so far, and he's got 138 yards and one touchdown. Second and ten. Ball at the 46 yard Number seven throws a bullet and is caught at the 35. And he's stopped right there. That will bring up first down. Randy Moss goes one on one on this play and beats his man. He executed that pass pattern perfectly and made the catch. Nice reception. Nope, they could not cover him man to man. He was one step ahead of the defense. Nice catch, Peter, and his stats reflect that. Definitely, Dan. He's now got 95 yards on nine catches. Number 26 makes it for his 14th carry and gains about three yards. Second down, both tight ends left. Number 26 barrels off his left guard and gains about three yards. Okay, so we went over all we can practice. Now we're going to get it to the top. And we're going to go just like it is. We're going to execute and we're going to stay strong and we're going to get to the spot we need to. Okay, fellas? Wow, look at those tackles. That's how you play sideline to sideline. This one will fall incomplete. That will bring up fourth down. Fourth down, and the field goal unit is on the field. And 
Anderson with the 44-yard attempt, and it's good. Gary Anderson kicks the field goal, but watch how close the ball gets to the upright. Man, a few more inches and he'd have made the highlight reel. Not the way he would have wanted to, though. That field goal makes him three for three out there. Hasn't Mr. missed Berger one yet. And you can't coach that. There's the signal, and we're ready. Berger kicks this one away. Number 83 fields this one deep at the one. Tackled at the 25. Number 83 got out close to the 20 on that one, so his decision to take it out of the end zone didn't really pay off, but it didn't really hurt him either. The Patriots stalled early last drive, and we'll have to wait and see what happens here. They'll start at their own 25-yard line. Number 83 goes in motion. Number 39 gains five on the play, and that brings up second down. Second and four. Ball off the Patriots, 30 yards. Number 39 will get the carry on second down, and gains about three yards. Third down, just a single receiver on the field. Okay, bring him out. Bring him out. We got the chains. No first, baby, no first. No first, baby, no first. First and ten. Ball at the Patriots, 35 yard line. Richter, Richter. Single back, single back. Got the trail. And he won his mind, and he won his mind. Number 39 gets the ball, and he will lose about a yard here. Derek Alexander not only cleaned the ball carrier's clock in the backfield, but buffed and polished it, too. Big hit for a loss. That's his second tackle so far. The Patriots, 34 yard line. Empty, empty, empty. I see three. I see three. Too Brady fires this one over the middle and it's tipped incomplete. Robert Griffith swatted that one away cleanly. The receiver didn't have a prayer in getting that one. That is their fourth batted ball. Tell you, we've seen a number of good defensive plays from this squad. We sure have. We'll see if they can keep it up, though. Third down, one man back. Moss grabs the rope right side and tries to get free. Five and touchdown. Touchdown, Patriots. Randy Moss will not take no for an answer. Watch this play where he makes the catch and then knifes ahead for plenty more. Wasn't supposed to be a touchdown pass, but he made it one with that terrific run after the catch. He fights for every inch he can get out there so you don't leave any daylight between him and the end zone. As you can see, he's up over the century mark. Oh, he came to play today. Now the point after, and it's good. gets the signal and we're set number three blockets this one deep number 37 downs this in the end zone for a touchback watch the counter watch the counter we ain't tripped open we ain't tripped open 
Number seven throws a heater right sideline and it's knocked away from the receiver incomplete. Number seven is checking off his receivers, finding the open man, and that's evident as you review the chart here. Note the short passes and how that's enabled him to rack up 151 yards and one touchdown. Second and ten. Oh, the Vikings, 20 yards. Take it back. Take it back. Number 26, chews up four yards, and that brings up third down. And that'll do it for the third quarter. The Vikings are out in front, 16 to 10. Number 26 goes right up the middle and converts the third and long. First down, Vikings. Number 26 is bullying it up the middle with moderate success. I think he needs to vary it up a little bit to keep the D off guard. Up to now, he's accumulated 66 yards on 17 carries. First down, two wideouts on the field. Number 26 will get the carry on first down and choose up about four on the play. Junior Seau with the tackle. Wow, those are nice stats. Way to carry the ball. Number seven just rifles this one and it's tipped incomplete. Mike Grable swatted that one away cleanly. The receiver didn't have a prayer in getting that one. They have really gotten after the ball as a team today. That is their fifth batted ball. Nice, aggressive deep. Number 26 will get the carry on third down and gets well past the markers for a first. Number 26 has a great offensive line in front of him. They made that play happen. Yep, those blockers opened up the hole for him. A huge game. A nice game, and they easily convert on third down. Yeah, that was a good call. First down, both wide outs to the right. Number seven, zings it to the right side, and it's tipped incomplete. Number 27, knocked that pass down. And he made sure the only one to touch the football was him. A nice defensive play will give him his second batted ball of the game. Yeah, great read there. Second and ten. Ball at the Vikings, 50 yards. Brable <laughs> gets the sack at the 47. Holding, number 27, defense. Five-yard penalty, automatic first down. Number 27, nearly earned the flag on this one. He held his man a little too obviously here. Yep, defensive holding is the call, and I got to agree with that. Let's go, T. Stanley. Ball the 45. Larry, Larry, Larry. Number seven throws a heater right sideline and it falls incomplete. Josh Reed dropped the ball so fast there you'd think it bit 